How's it everybody, how we doing? Um, I see the uh, convicted sexual predator who has been convicted for a sex crimes put another video on this uh, this shadow boxer fella, you know what I mean? Shouldn't really ever ever give a convicted sexual offender any airtime. But what I should be doing is giving them one hell of a beating. So I'm gonna have to do this to get in front of you, shadow boxer to beat you to death, you know what I mean, because, let's face it, all the world likes to see sex offenders get beat up, and there'll be a million people chanting for me, tearing you apart on that day, you have nothing in your arsenal to stop me, any punch you chuck, I'd walk through you, you know what I mean, anything, I'd just walk straight through it and break your full face in one punch, but another thing, obviously you and Decker have um, not got it on, Uh Due to, I don't know what reasons, he don't seem to fight anyone anyway. Well, he does. He had a fight with a guy who he thinks he can beat when he gave six stone away. Well, when Robbie come in five or six stone lighter than him and showed him up. He'll only, he'll only fight you if he thinks he's got half a chance. All this with Danny Christie on at the minute is, uh, is ridiculous. You know what I mean? Basically, he's just, he's just an idiot. I'm not getting into that anyway. But yeah, uh, shadow boxer fella. Um, I seen you saying you want it in Ireland now. However, I, I'm cool, man. I'll fly to Ireland and put you in. Yeah, so that's that really. Um, another thing. Who is it? Who is the other one? Neil? Remember when uh, Decker were getting um, were getting fresh with uh, the fat fella from uh, Rotherham, Chalk Ice. I'm wanting some warm up fights, Chuck Ice, and you'll be a warm up. So, uh, December time, just have your phone on standby and I'll get you on. And uh, I'll put charging as well, because I have forgot about when you were putting things about me there. So, you better be able to back it. But it'll be an easy night for your journeyman. You get a couple hundred quid in your pocket after taking a beating or whatever. So, that's what journeymen do. So, make sure you have your phone on standby, kid, yeah? No worries, son. And. Uh, yeah, I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna say about anyone else. Uh, no one else is serious as coming me path. Um, I know uh, the Jack Draper situation for the BKFC. Um, he says he's entwined to fight someone else on that card anyway. But he says he he says he'll fight. He says he'll fight me on the BKFC after he fights this fella. Whoever he's going up against, who has not been named yet or announced. But if it doesn't happen for some reason, Jack. I'll step in and me and you have a few bangs respectfully. I ain't got a problem with you, but I just think it'd be a cracking fight. And um, yeah, that's that's about it, boy. About as far as it goes. So I just thought I'd keep you updated on that. Uh, and that's it, yeah. So I'm going to chill out on this for a while now and just keep on cracking on what I'm doing. And I'll let you know when any dates and announcements are set in place uh, for the time being. I'm going to put some good content on about tr uh, true crime and real factions of life and real life experiences. I just did a, uh, a little mini documentary earlier with uh, KRN TV, if you tune in. Uh, the part two stage of, of the last video I did. It's just been uploaded an hour ago, guys. So if you haven't seen it, tune in. And I'm doing a, a full documentary with them on midday Monday. So another two days away. That'll be a sit down, nice couple hour interview and uh, nothing will be off limits. So if you've got any questions regarding what you've ever heard of me or anything you want to put to me or anything, what you think you know about me, then please message uh, my man, KRN TV, uh, list of questions and I'll answer everything there. And then I'm an open book. What you see is what you get. Uh, it's on the label. So trust me, have a great day, guys. Stay lucky.